We have a great community guest tonight. Her name is Lisa Dermangian, and she is known as the founder of Fashion Business Accelerator 360. And I'd like to let you tell everybody else what uh, Fashion Business Accelerator 360 is all about. Sure, thank you so much. Sure. Thanks for having me. Uh, Fashion Accelerator 360 is an online education platform and community for all things fashion. So on Fashion Accelerator, you can take four week classes with industry experts and it's all basically online. And we have a six week boot camp coming up that we'll talk about later that I'm really sort of excited about. But we teach everything from launch your line to business of blogging to PR, social media 101, uh, DIY events, branding A to Z. That's great. So I'm just going to assume that fashion boot camp is not about making camo fashionable again. No, although it should. Um, <laughs> Duck Dynasty did 400 million in oh sales <laughs> just on their product, so that might be a good class to add. Well, so what is ex exactly fashion boot camp? So the fashion boot camp is a six-week. Um, it's we're calling it a boot camp, but it's really like an online conference with education added added to it. So we have six different uh, top tier speakers that give a presentation every week on a webcast, and with that comes homework. But the students get to obviously attend the live webcast and chat questions, ask questions to these industry leaders. We've just confirmed the fashion editor from uh, Mary Claire. We have one of the editors from Fashionista, we think, that's almost uh, said yes. We have, one of the, we have uh, a great designer. We're really excited, actually, about this six-week boot camp. So I'm interested. Uh, when you say homework, I get triggers of long essays and math, and I hate that. What kind of homework do you give away to fashion students? The, the idea of Fashion Accelerator is the homework that's given gets the student in the four weeks or in the six weeks to be able to launch their line via samples, via specs, via however, how, however much time they want to put into it. Right. For the business of blogging, the idea is that um, for the blogging course, we've had several students launch their blogs. So the whole concept of Fashion Accelerator is if you, if you actually do all the homework, you'll be able to complete whatever it is your task, your task is for those four weeks. Um, my first week's assignment is mood boards so okay. that you can actually really uh, deliver what your DNA is for your line. It's really knowing who you are, knowing who your customer is, all done through mood boards. Uh, another week is spec sheets and finding factories that would be right for you. Another week is finding the top 10 retail stores you feel your line would be best suited in. It's, right. it's very doable. It's anywhere from half hour to four hours a week, depending upon how much the student wants to put into it. And I love that. And we were talking earlier about, you know, sometimes the shortcomings of a university or an educational system is that you'll learn things that aren't quite applicable in real life when you find yourself out looking for a job. And yet, what Fashion Business Accelerator 360 offers is actually real life, you know, learning things that you can apply once you're ready to go and start your business. So um, l let me know a little bit more about what students have reached out to you post your education and how they've been able to apply what they've learned to uh, their career. Yeah, no, it's super excellent. Um, so our first graduating class from our four-week classes was February, and one of the designers from my class has added, has done over 30,000 in sales, her sale, wow. which is huge, because she'd only done one season, and I mean, she's, it's her, you know, she's just starting, it's just her. Um, she's gotten into wholesale, so she was doing direct-to-consumer or one-of-a-kind mm -hmm. product before she took our class. Now she's actually selling to retail stores, which That's is quite amazing. a big deal. Um, she's about to secure a sales rep. We had a Parsons student who had graduated fashion design from Parsons who took my launch your line, and he's now showing at uh, New York Fashion Week That's in impressive. September. We've had a few students launch their blogs after taking the business of blogging. Um, so we've had a few people get jobs from their teachers, which is the whole community aspect that, that Fashion Accelerator gives because you're networking with people that are in the industry, working in the industry. They're doing this because they want to give back. I mean, we pay our teachers too, but, <laughs> but not a ton. You know, so they're doing it because they love it. And we give them nuts and bolts. Like at the, you know, there's, there is a bit of a, um, a stumbling point for education right now with what's happening in business in all industries but especially in fashion because fashion is moving so fast in so many different directions that a lot of people can't afford or don't have time or by the time they finish university they still don't have the tools to get up and do what it is they right. want to do and now we're in debt. 
I know that for sure. <laughs> um, something really impressive you told me earlier, you said that your students come all walks of life and that they're actually global. You have young students, older students. Uh, tell me a little bit more about that, the, the people that are signing up for your... Yeah, so we've had students as young as, you know, 17, 18 to as old as in their mid-60s, which I know isn't that old, but when you're starting a new career, that's I think that's amazing. Right. Um, Dubai, Kuwait, Brazil, Mexico, um, Ireland. That sounds really it's, successful it's, that you've touched lives yeah, that far. it's great. So I'm a little curious. You're all the way from, you say, you split your time between New York and Vancouver, really far off from Las Vegas. So what brought you down here this week, and what have you experienced about our community? Well, um, our blog editor, Kelsey, who's here, Kelsey Smith, told me about Stitch Factory. Raise your hand, Kelsey. Yeah, and she connected me. <laughs> She connected me to Rachel at Stitch Factory, and then Rachel had asked uh, asked if I would do I would be a part of the speaker series, which was last night. So I was coming for Magic Trade Show anyway, which is next week, but I came a week early That's to awesome. be part of the Stitch Factory. A Magic this month Trade Show for apparel, the apparel oh, okay. Magic Trade Show. Yeah. Okay. Um, so I, I came early, and I just think it's amazing. I had heard about I had heard about downtown? Stitch Factory oh, in downtown Vegas, but the community and the sharing and the culture that's being built here is. It's incredible. It's, it's, really great. it's lovely to see that visitors can see that because we are really proud about what we're building down here. It's amazing. That's awesome. And if people want to connect with you and learn a little bit more about Fashion Accelerator 360, how can they reach you online? Online, uh, Fashion Accelerator, the short one is www.fba360.com. And if you go to, if you email me at hello, at FBA360.com. That's me that answers those emails, so you'll get right to me. That's awesome. And Twitter accounts? Yeah. Twitter account is at FBA360 is our Twitter. That's great. Thank you so much for being on this show. Thank you for having me. Thank you. Hashtag.